Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Appreciate you guys tuning in once again. Make sure you guys subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that like button. Share this video with a friend. The uh, channel is growing fast. We're creeping up on 600 subscribers. Guys, this is a video where Tanner and I, he is a co-worker of mine, a friend of mine, uh, we go out to Timber Creek Lake. We take the Hobies out there. He's rocking the 360 and uh, me and my 180. And uh, we have a good little time fishing out there for two, two and a half hours long after work from about six to eight or 8.30. So uh, we'll go ahead, cut right to some on the water footage. And again, guys, if you're not subscribed, make sure to do so. Appreciate you. Let's get some water. Sit out for a little while. There he is, right there. <laughs> the man who caught it. Don't forget the guide who put him on the fish, though. <laughs> yeah, Brett can't do this. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, I didn't realize my freaking camera was just wobbling back there. I was like, what is he doing over there? It looks like he's holding something up. Yeah. Yeah, no biggie, just a four pounder. Okay. All right, let him get some water. Make sure he's good. Okay. Here you go. Hold on to him real nice and tight. Look at that. She pretty. All right, 
We got it zeroed. Hold on to it real good for me. Right at four. 401? <laughs> 401, yeah. Called it. 401. There it is. Heck yeah, dude. It's good fish. Nice fish. You want to get a picture with it? Yeah, I got something I did myself, but yeah. Dude, we just keep sliming Eddie's boats. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hey, you want to get a length on it? Oh, uh, yeah, we can. Twenty. Nice. Heck yeah. Let's get a release on that big girl. There she goes. Heck yeah, man. Good job. I guess uh, I'm gonna follow him. <laughs> So tell me about it. Like riding that timber over there, there's a rock ledge that sticks out. Yeah. Like a concrete pad. Right. I was snagging, I was snagging the jig on it. Yeah. It popped up over the concrete slab. And as soon as it did that, I could, I could feel it popping up. And as soon as it did that, it felt like I got snagged. But <laughs> that's on the line going <laughs> off to the side. And, Dude. Hell yeah. Oh, an ocean. That's a big one. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Hell yeah. Gotta do that again. Check the mic and make sure it sounds right, boys. Sound right, boy. Well, I definitely hold the record. He's got the biggest, I've got the smallest. Are we going for the biggest or the smallest? Oh, okay. Well, I got you beat on the smallest. Sound right, boy. It sound right, boy.
nice fish, guys. Healthy. He bit that swim jig. This is the Divine Swim Jig from Six Cents. And I've got that Divine Swim Bait on here. Nice little pairing. I noticed I had a fish come up and follow it right up to the boat and he just got, he probably would have hit it, but he saw the boat and got spooked off. So decided to kind of slow down over here a little bit and uh, it paid off. I'm gonna say 15 inches. Alright guys, we're going to go ahead and let him go. You guys hit it right at the boat. That was nuts. That first fish that I spooked right at the boat keyed me in on this swim jig bite. They want it moving. That's not a big fish, but he's thick. These fish are healthy in here, guys. They're up in this grass. They're feeding on shad. They're feeding on bait fish. They've got They've got everything they need to hide and ambush these bait fish, guys. So that swim jig is the deal right now. We're going to keep throwing it. He about knocked the rod out of my hand. Right at the boat, I was getting ready to pull that sucker out of the water and he just, boom, I barely had any line out at all. bass out here hitting the swim jig. We found what they're on guys. These are some thick little bass. That's a dang near two pounder, but probably one and three quarters, but he's got a belly on him. So, hey guys, they're feeding up on these bait fish. Let's go ahead and take advantage of it. Let's keep putting some fish in the boat. Yeah, and they've been busting out, like out more in the middle, like where you just cast it too. going and then pull your drive out and just kind of coast into the ramp. Oh there's a bunch of bait fish right here dude. Okay. Yeah a whole bunch of them.
can get this part under there too if you want. Alright guys, that's a wrap. So as you can see, we made it out till dark. Tanner caught what might be his new PB out here. So pretty excited about that. Four on the pounds. Four pounder on the big jig with the uh, six cents prawn on the back of that sucker. So we caught a handful of fish otherwise, caught a couple on the plopper and the swim jig. But uh, we just might have to make this a weekly routine. So anyways guys, this was just a little weeknight. Uh, two and a half hour long trip out here at Timber Creek Lake and uh, we're out here in Winfield, Kansas. Alright guys, stay tuned. Make sure you get subscribed. Hit that notifications bell. That way you see new videos when we post them. We'll see you guys on the next one.